everybody, I'm here today to tell you why electrical appliances are grounded. I'll be going over the specific reasoning for grounding electrical appliances. Now this is the type of outlet that exists where I live. And if you take a look at it, this pin right here, this odd shaped hole, okay, this odd shaped hole is for the ground pin. And this green screw is for the ground wire, which eventually gets majorly grounded when you get close to the electrical panel. Now why do we ground electrical appliances, lights, outlets and everything of that nature well there are four specific reasons number one grounding protects from surges of electricity so a surge can happen lightning can strike your home and various other types of surges can happen with electricity it's really power that's running through wires so surges can happen all of the excess electricity will actually go to the earth rather than to you and the appliances. So if uh, a surge happens, which hopefully it doesn't, but if it does happen, all of that ac excess electricity will end up going through the ground, uh, through the ground pin, okay, to the ground screw, through the ground wires, to the earth, okay? So it pr protects from surges. Um, number two is it directs electricity to where it needs to go safely, okay? It takes the electricity and makes sure that it goes where it needs to go. It does not allow it to take any other pathways that it shouldn't take. So like, let's say there's a short and you know, a, one of the wires is touching the electrical box, the ground will take the electricity and it will send it to the earth, okay? It takes the electricity, sends it to where it needs to go. The third reason is it actually stabilizes the overall voltage levels so it protects from spikes so I mean if you're using an electrical appliance you're gonna get a stable voltage you're not gonna get ups and downs with regards to the power and the level of electricity running to the appliance or the light or anything like that you're you know you're not gonna see like flickering or dimming or like bright lights and then dim lights and anything like that the voltage is stabilized because of the grounding okay and also the fourth reason is it actually utilizes the best conductor um, which is the earth okay and essentially uh, electricity takes the path of least resistance you probably remember this from school um, and if you don't remember it then you should know it anyways it just makes makes it easy to understand how electricity works so grounding gives it the path of least resistance directly to the earth so if there's ever any excess electricity it's gonna take the path of least resistance instead of you or the appliance it's gonna go towards the earth if all goes well in older homes with older wiring um, there isn't a ground a ground wire that goes you know through the wiring in the walls but you can still ground appliances and lights and outlets uh, to the box itself to the electrical box that will give you some level of protection um, but basically if you want the best the best electrical wiring situation you should have a ground wire in all the wires throughout the house and that ground wire should eventually lead to the earth and that's basically it if you like this video please be sure to give it a thumbs up let me know what you think down below as a comment and of course be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one and that's all i have for you today thanks for watching